Alright, what's up everybody? We're back with another episode of Gosu Tekken. My name is Eris, and I'm here once again with Rip. What's up, Rip? What's up? Alright, dude, I'm gonna make some money today. So... <laughs> I think he's going by $3. Yeah, fuck that. that. This is a clean slate. This is a new season. <laughs> what? <Gosu Tekken. laughs> Alright, first up, who do we got? Nell. We got Nell. Nell versus Dragon Nell. Versus Chanel, Chanel, according to you. Uh, Chanel's Elisa. Now, you got the inside scoop here, dude. I want to take Dragon off, of course. Take him, then. Have you played these guys? Or you were I've just never played them? Nell, but I have played Chanel. And I did do decently against him, actually. One of the few guys I did okay against. Okay, so uh, what you're saying is he's a scrub. All right, all right. Right. You got, <laughs> you got the he has a very nice restaurant, though. Very Does close really? to arcade, yeah. Gorgogi restaurant? Uh, actually, I didn't get to eat there. I think it's like uh, Katsu, though. Katsu? Isn't like fried chicken? chicken? Oh god, I don't like that. All right, so so I got Dragon off. You got uh, Chanel. Mm -hmm. uh, so let's see how this goes. Um, personally, this matchup I gotta say is uh, relatively frustrating because of how good her movement is. So I don't know. I mean, I, I think that's a limitation that every character faces against Elisa, though. Yeah, but I mean, Dragonoff is one of the more linear characters. Linear characters? Yeah. yeah, I mean, you know, he has tools to be tracking, of course, but. Uh, one of his best tools, tools for tracking is uh, down two, and she can back that shit really easily. Mm -hmm. So I like that back swing blow right there, though. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I noticed uh, actually the couple of Dragonovs that I do play in Korea, their back swing blows are totally like not from setups. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's the usually like out of spacing and just boom. Yeah, well, out of spacing, it's really hard to do it. But yeah, I mean that's generally the best way to do it, just you know by feel. Mm -hmm. But you know, I don't know. It's like got to be pro to do that shit. They are. Yeah. That's the, what the word on the street is. I feel like this is kind of unfair now. This is the first Gosu Tekken we've commentated since you've been back. And I feel like you have <laughs> inside scoop. Like, you know everything about the players. and you Nah, man. Arcade. I, I, I only know, like, the top guys. You know, the, everyone else. I mean, like, Nell, I would have read his name, but I didn't play him, though, for sure. Well, Nell is about to fuck up Chanel right now, dude. Damn. Oh, Moving around real well. Oh, oh. See? It's out of nowhere. Well, Actually, that, that wasn't even back. They all look the same, man. They come yeah, up with an elbow. That was a nice running, too. Let's see what he does. Come on, Chanel. You know I what? You take Chanel. Yeah, that's what I heard. Anyway, you know when you knock down uh, with Dragonoff, what you could do is if you want to do a stomp, uh, you could do down 3 plus 4. And if they tech roll, you get down three for some reason. Oh, and and there is no move. There is no down three plus four when... Uh, they're standing. Yeah, they're standing. So if they tech roll, you get down three, and it still works. It still hits uh, low, which is pretty good. I don't know if this guy's doing that or not, but it seemed like he did a down three in that oh. instance. Now bringing it back. No, I ain't bringing shit. Hey, uh, so what's this arcade like? Is it cool? I mean, you got to hang out there and play, right? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's... it's you know, we've already seen it and talked about it before, but, I mean, it's just 40 Tekken cabinets. You know what I mean? It's just ridiculous. And then I mean, got... the, the atmosphere compared to Japanese arcades, because, you know, I've been to Japanese arcades. How is it? Like, is it similar? What's it like? Yeah, yeah, I would say it's similar, except it's a lot brighter, I feel like. And since there's not everyone, you know, there's no smoking indoors, so it's a lot easier to play without, like, crying. Oh, fuck. Uh, so, <laughs> I mean, the, the thing is, when people do want to smoke, they just go right outside the door. And it's on the second floor, so there's kind of like a little balcony up there. Oh, okay. Up where the staircase is, so people just kind of smoke in there. You can smoke in the staircase, which is... Yeah, like they do that. Mm -hmm. Really? I wonder why they don't just let you smoke in the arcade. I don't know. Okay. I like it. Time's running out. At least it's oh, about nice. to end. Come on, make it happen, Chuck. No. Oh, yes, sir. Uh, it's uh, too long. Random hop kicks, dude. The way to do it with Elisa, man. That's the best thing in the game. All right, let's see what happens now. They're all yeah. There's a, there's a guy Genki on uh, my website Level Two Game, and he's he keeps on making these comments about since that Slips video about hey, uh -huh. you know, pop kicks. You I'm mean, sorry, art Slips article right on your side of one puddle about uh you know those random hop kicks mm -hmm. and the crutch system. And yeah. no matter what I post up now, he always starts talking about you know what players think about what's random and why the game is better or worse than any other previous Tekken. 
So. He's having a monologue or what? Is yeah, pretty monologue? much. I mean, I, I end up like responding to him, like with like, you know, two sentences. You know, it's like, uh, you know, he asked me if I agree with him. And so I, I put up a little response, and then the next thing I know, he's like got another paragraph and a half for me to read, you know? Well, <laughs> I I don't know. well that's cool. Chanel with the comeback. Takes I... match. Uh, oh, oh, uh, oh, yes. Am I ever going to fucking win a dollar on this <laughs> shit, dude? I always lose. I wouldn't right, get he's... paid. Yeah, I know. <laughs> this is theoretical money. Do, am I really down three dollars right now? Yeah. All right. If Look I go down, if I go down five, I'll pay. You. All right. But if you go down one, you gotta pay me. <laughs> we'll see. Nice. Let's get like it. Okay. Good combo. That's easy to do. Vanilla Master of Comebacks. Oh God! What the fuck did he do that for? <laughs> Why did he even do a down forward two up there? God. So I'm coming at him. These, oh, what the hell? This? You know, uh, playing mm. against Elisa it, on an infinite stage is really frustrating. The only thing that really, like, when I'm playing against Elisa, the only thing that I'm really looking for is getting her ass to the wall so she can't go anywhere. So this is pretty tough. I would say. <laughs> she has that, um, that wall run and fly away move, though. Yeah, but that shit doesn't work, man. You just fucking pretty good. pin her ass to the wall. That shit never works. Pretty good. You know what also is tough about this matchup? Uh, she has a bunch of lows that are minus 11, so you can't shoulder them, which is really annoying. Sounds like a good character. She's good. I mean, I don't think it's a bad matchup, but it's one of the tougher ones for Dragon Ball, I'd say. Yeah, I think is one of those characters where the better... The player you're playing against, the harder it gets. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Um, you know, an interesting thing is, um, you know, generally speaking, I would say that Tekken doesn't have matchup issues. Like, it's a pretty balanced game. Mm -hmm. But, as you know, I've recently been playing Fang, and, man, that character has tons of bad matchups. I, <laughs> what? Yeah, I feel like that character has a shitload of bad matchups. Maybe like, you're still learning the character. No, I don't think so. I think, <laughs> I, I think I'm past just learning the character and I'm able to like assess the problems with the character now because I mean I've been playing him for like already like six months already so um and I really feel like some of these matchups are fucking retarded like they some characters can take away some really key moves and the damage differential also is just preposterous sometimes you know like playing against Brian with Fang, even though I don't think that's a bad matchup, just the damage differential is like, just it makes you want to puke. It's terrible. It's terrible. So, you you're know, talking about juggles or punishers? Juggle damage differential. It's it's like it's it's like the thing is that you hit the, the same amount of launchers against the, the opponent and you will lose every time. You have to hit them with at least one or two more launchers on average to win. But yeah. if you have a better poke game and the launchers, and you have you know lower juggle damage, you should be okay, right? It, it theoretically works that way, but you know that's just on paper, and it, right. that's in a you know in reality you're gonna get clipped by launchers. You're gonna get a hit by an orbital heal. You're gonna get hit by a hop kick or whatever. And if you factor in the, the the stuff that you clip them with, the damage differential just makes a big difference in the end. That was really cheap. That was awesome. Janelle, two matches to zero. That's guaranteed if 1-1 one, one hits, uh, hits their... Their back, their side. Yeah. Oh, man. I always put the wrong guy. <laughs> right, you gotta support your character, man. Oh, yeah, this is the thing that tripped me out when I was playing Elisa's, actually. In Korea, they don't got the chainsaws, so she's got these you know laser games. I mean, I knew it, but, you know, I've never played against one. Yeah, it's uh, it's because of their... Um, I don't know what it's called, show. MSRB or whatever the hell. <laughs> But yeah, it's censored. You can't have chainsaws. And when she gives you her head, it doesn't come off. No, yeah, she, it's like a duplicate or something. Yeah, she just, like, immediately has another head. What is he doing, dude? There you He's go. Just with him, dude. Kick that fucking bitch. <laughs> Flying around. Oh, dude, come wow. on. There's a second hit to that. <laughs> there it is again. It's her bind move. Oh, oh man. This laser guy. beams. Lightsabers. Get him, dude. Got him. Funk you around like that? Come on, dude. Jesus. I feel like the the second <laughs> tier of Dragonoff players has rose to like the best Dragonoff players in Korea because the best ones quit Dragonoff. <laughs> like uh like Rain used to play Dragonoff and he doesn't anymore and then like 
Pole Man played Dragonoff back in the day, and he doesn't any. Oh, that was so fucked up right there. Tech rolled into back turn. So now, like, Galaxini and Nell and shit. Ocean <laughs> Risk. <coughs> this is no good. This is great. He had to change his outfit for this one. He looks <laughs> like a clown now. <laughs> yeah, he looks like one before. Alright. Yeah, this is gonna be free. Oh, God, that one one is so good. Yeah, I love that move. I actually started using her just uh, recently. Oh, yeah, right. Yep. Day two right now. You're <laughs> yeah, <that's> pretty recent. <laughs> yeah, that 1-1 one, one is really cheap. Really good. Yeah. Man, this is pretty good. Down 4-2 is uh, 16 frames with her, but man, he's using it really well. Oh, my gosh. Gives him a glimmer of hope. And oh, yeah, and that's the thing about uh, Korea 2. They play on plus one. What the hell does that mean? 10% more health in their life. Yeah, that's why that like that move would have killed him in the USA, but over there... Are you serious? I didn't know that. Dude, it was so hard for me, because, like, you know, I, I simplified my loss. I do, like, the simple wall combos and stuff. Yeah. Like, it's not enough damage over there. They do a different... Uh, on Tekken Crash 2? Yeah. What? Yeah. Why 10% more? It's just, in the arcade, it's plus one. I mean, it's a setting, you know what I mean? Why do like, they... Like, what's their uh, logic? That it makes the game more balanced or, you know what I mean, less broken or whatever. Do you more agree less with random. that? I don't know. It's just, it's different. They don't do that in Japan, right? No, they don't. And, um, for example, when we were there, Fab, like, you know, he came in there playing Miguel, and after, like, two days, he's like, you know, I don't think I can do this in Tekken Class. I gotta use Bob, you know? Because of the damage difference? Right, exactly. Wow. That makes me respect, uh, How's Fang way more. I mean, damn, (laughs) this guy's doing even less damage. Right, see? I mean, it's, it's crazy. Yeah, that's I, I didn't even realize it until Fab started talking about it. Yeah, I had no idea. I never noticed it on videos or anything. But, I mean, 10% isn't that much when you're not playing yourself. And, you know, if you're just watching. Yeah, I mean, it, it really messes with you, though, when you're like, okay, I just got to do this move to kill him, and it's good, you know? Or yeah. this combo's going to kill him, and it's not, you know? It's pretty wild. And this guy is... Oh! There we go, Chanel now one round away from the dollar. No, dude, he's gonna take this one. Regular Nell, not Chanel. He's only half a Chanel, dude. We gotta make a new name for Nell, dude. I'm gonna call him Nell Gibson. <laughs> <laughs> Nell so Gibson, tall. dude. That's it. Oh, God, dude. He's gonna get him right now, dude. Nell Gibson, fuck him up. Passion of the Christ, let's do this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Lethal weapon. <laughs> the sickest movies ever. Danny Glover's been on his last week of before retirement <laughs> for the last 20 years, dude. Yeah. He's too sick. Nell Gibson, he's, he's going to take this round as soon as I gave him that name. God, those pokes are really cheap. Mm-hmm. Oh. Wow, I didn't realize back when he could give you float juggles. No. Oh. He's just getting crazy. He doesn't realize this is Nell Gibson. <laughs> Damn, good movement, man. Oh, ten strings. Uh-oh. Uh, Damn. Closed it out. There it goes. Didn't lose a match. Damn. Chanel's got a serious unibrow. <laughs> He's pretty, man. Oh, actually, yeah, that's one of the things he said to me when he saw me. He said, yeah, a very pretty face. He said that to you? That was like day one. Damn. Next up, we got Bin Chen with... Wait a minute. Don't change the subject. Versus... <laughs> ho So what happened between... ho I'll take the lead player. Um... You're going to take Pong Ho? That's probably a bad idea, isn't it? I- I'll take Bin Chang, all right. Yeah, I'll give you a chance. I've got $4 on you now. Come on, yeah, that dioxin in the background. Me. Oh, man. I recognize people as JDCR. This is crazy. As I said last time. I think that's Tomball. They're all JDCR, dude. Although, supposed to beat that? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so you got Pong Ho. Is yeah, that, I guess I so. I think from, uh... From, uh... What's that movie that everyone talks about? Bloodsport? <laughs> no, that's Chong Lee. No, not that guy. The guy that moves his titties around. That's Chong Lee. It is? I thought his name was something else. Isn't it? No, it's not Chong Lee. It's like... He's Chinese, isn't he? I don't know. No, oh, no, no. He's a... 
don't remember. Yes, buff guy. Yeah, I know the the final guy, right? No, the big the guy. Whatever. Who gives a shit? Tong Ho <laughs> versus Bin Chang. I met this guy at a WCG. You met him too, right? Yeah, yeah, I did. He doesn't have quite the like charisma that I expected from him. You Why know? do you expect him to have charisma? I don't know. Every like uh, Korean Tekken player I've met has been so like unique. Like you know, um, whole man. He's all about the chicks and the money and like. You know, he wears, like, risers in his shoes and shit. <laughs> yeah. and, like, you know, he's, like, a cool guy, you know? And then, like, then he's, like, super weird and wears all these goofy colors. And he's, like, you know, he's, like, a cool guy, too. And then, like, me, he's, like, the boss, you know? He doesn't really talk. <laughs> and he's he just, like, constantly thinking about jet uppercuts all day and shit. <laughs> and, like, but then Bin Chang, when I met him, he was, like, hey, what's up? Yeah. No, yeah, he speaks, like, not terrible English either. Yeah, he's not bad. He speaks English. It was like, it was up, nice to meet you. All right. And yeah. I was like, come on, dude. You gotta do something. JDCR is cool, too, man. JDCR, when I met him, he was like, oh, I was sharing a hotel room with him, right? And mm -hmm. then, like, he decided, like, okay, you know, it's time to sleep. I'm going to change. So that fool takes off his shirt, and he's like, fucking groundskeeper Willie and shit. He's like, super <laughs> buff. Are you serious? Swear to God, dude, JDCR is, like, super buff. Like, what? I'm telling you, he looks like he's a tiny, like, little Asian kid. But yeah. he's, like, super pecs and, like, arm muscles and shit. And then, like, <laughs> I, I was like, dude, what the fuck is this? And he goes, lift weights? And I'm like, damn, <laughs> <laughs> all right, fine, fuck it. You know, speaking of JDCR, dude, yeah. um, when he came to MLG, you know, he he didn't do so well, right? He didn't even get top eight for at Dallas. Right. But, man, let me tell you. It must have been tournament or something, because that guy is one of the best players I've ever played. Yeah, he's really good. I played him in Japan. He's hella good, dude. Yeah, I, 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 you know, I didn't play him anywhere else. I didn't see him much either. So when I played him in Korea, I was like, what? Why is this guy so good? <laughs> like, <laughs> this? <laughs> yeah, he's super good, man. They just showed him at Reach Tekken God with fucking his secondary. Yeah, so. that was, I mean, I was there when he was uh, playing for it, so that was pretty cool. Wow, really? <clears throat> yeah, he's... Pungo got the first match? How do I always end up losing? It's like impossible. Look at my odds here. Bin Chang is Pung Ho. <laughs> I Pung Ho and I lose? Dude, this is whack. Pung Ho! Kick the shit out of that lead player. Alright, minus 14. Yeah. Nice punish. Yeah, stand <laughs> two. Stand two. Tight. I'm losing money to this guy. There we go. Bin Chang's main is Lars, though, right? So, he's secondary. He's or... a lot of characters. I mean, he plays Bob, Lars, Bruce. I've seen him play, like, a lot of characters. I don't know what his real main is, to be honest. Hmm. Oh, I was going to say, when we met Bin Chang at WCG, mm -hmm. it was, I felt the day I met him, at least, was before the main tournament that he was going to be in. So, I felt like he was sandbagging a lot and not really, you know making friends or anything so I was thinking maybe that's why he wasn't that scared <laughs> he was sandbagging his friendship and shit yeah dude <laughs> wow. he was he was there on a business trip man wow shit alright maybe that has to do with it maybe he has some crazy charismatic personality <laughs> they both just started the hop kick yeah yeah they're not that good what's that guy's name on your website what the guy on your website that's saying how hop kicks aren't that good oh Genki Genki pseudo dude Genki hop kicks are tight Mm -mm -mm. Oh my god. Oh. Do you know how unsafe that launcher is? I think it's safe, right? I don't think it's safe. The Hitman one? <laughs> yeah, I don't think it is, is it? I don't know. Fuck, I don't know anything about this character. I just one to one that shit all day. What? Even if it's safe? No, before it comes out. Oh, I see. Oh wow, I didn't know you could interrupt it like that. I thought it crushed his eyes. It does, but for some reason one to one seems to work pretty well against it. Hmm. Maybe it's just after if they hit you with down three and then go into Hitman and then do it. Maybe the frames just add up in that scenario. Ouch. Four, two, one. Get him. Pong hole. Get the match. Come on. No. <laughs> Pong hole. <Get> the <laughs> yeah. All right. This guy's oh. name is Bong hole, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ben Chambers is Bong hole. <laughs> 
Oh, uh, this is the best part of doing the commentary. Just tucking shit. I can't believe I'm going to lose this. This is unbelievable. <laughs> oh my gosh. And he's fucking him up now, too. <laughs> Alright, there you go. No he's blood, dude. dude. Nice. Uh oh. Nice. Don't get cocky. Oh. 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 One more hit. Da yeah. Why did he go with the 10 string? <laughs> All the other Korean dudes in the back are like, what the fuck? That's how you get demoted, man. I shouldn't have bet on being changed. <laughs> oh, God. Boom. There's a punish. Oh, man. Taking him out. He's got rage. Boom. Jeez. Four, four, three. One round away. Hey, this is going to be $5. Time to celebrate. You gotta get five dollars at the end of the episode. Oh god, whatever. Nice. It's not gonna be five dollars. <laughs> there you go. Kick that shit. Well, I don't know about that wake up. Soon. Come on. There you go. Mmm. Animal mm -hmm. Oh. Easy to do. <laughs> Easy to do. He's <laughs> gotta do mids, man. It's easy to do. Oh god. Oh, good punish. He's punished correctly. Yeah, there, you go. there you go. There you go. God. Ugh. That's fucked up. Those combos are... God. You think they're going to change this stuff in Tag 2? What stuff? Like these uh -oh. Uh, wall damage and stuff like uh -oh. that. Uh-oh. I don't know. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, I, I I hope they change some of this uh, crazy wall damage, like Bruce or like uh, Lee. Even I don't know, maybe Lee's okay. He's not that high. Yeah, his wall game's really good though. Yeah, it is. It's a good wall game, but it's it's like not guaranteed, so it's fair, I think. Interesting. Boom! Get him! Get him! Get him! Uh oh, dropping combo. Come on, dude, what is he doing? Getting demoted. Does he not realize? Uh oh. Alright, here we go. <laughs> oh, God. Don't get your back in the wall until you die every time. Kim. There you go. Uh oh, that bad shit. news. Uh oh. Oh, God. You're get fucking him. up. That's yes. punishable. Yes. yes. Oh. I didn't know that was launch punishable. How did I? But it's $5. Son of a bitch. Five. $5. Uh -oh. oh, man. Oh. Uh, you you're want, no longer allowed to come with me. Who do you want? You got bunghole, right? I got all the way through. All right, fine. Yeah, I'll take Vin Chang again. <laughs> he's never done me wrong yet. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think he's won your match yet. Yeah, I know. I'm never going to win anything on this fucking show. Ever. <laughs> I've never won once. You've won once. I oh, God. Damn. See that shit? Saw. Bunghole's puckering up, dude. <laughs> Man. He's getting kind of scared. Yeah, you know, I feel like in a, like there's a Korean Steve style. Really? Yeah, and so no matter, like after I played the first Korean guy, like who, I think it was Dong Dong, first Korean Steve I played. And, <laughs> Dong Dong? <laughs> yeah, I mean like, you know, you play him and you, you feel like he's not like the best, mm -hmm. but the stuff he does is the same stuff that all the other guys do. What's so you kind of learn all the... What are you talking about? I don't know, just the way they use, like, down back 3, 2, or course, or core 1. You know, like, basic stuff. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, I feel like they're a lot more aggressive with down back 3. Uh, than it's a timing the, issue, or what? I think so. Like, their spacing and, you know, I guess, spacing and what else? Just how they use it. Like, I feel like, um, uh, when I play Korean, well, I've only played Nin, but when I played Nin, mm -hmm. I felt like one thing that really separated him from uh, other Steves I've played is the way he used instant peekaboo, like... He would just, like, be in your face and then instant peekaboo launcher, and, like, I wasn't even thinking about a launcher. Yeah. Like, well, you know, that's, just, that's Nin. Yeah, maybe that's just Nin, but I really... That surprised me. His instant peekaboo shit was really fast. And also, he does, like, wall standing 1 plus 2 in places where it takes a lot of balls to do it, and he just does it, and then it hits. So, <laughs> that was one thing I noticed, too, but this guy better make me a buck. Uh oh. Don't lose this round, it's gonna be critical. Oh, parry that! You could delay hop kick that shit. 
Uh-oh. Trouble, punch him. trouble, Oh, yeah. I didn't know you could do that. He didn't punch fast enough. Mm. Boy. Ouch. I like it when Pumbo's got his back to the wall, he always makes up down three and up forward four. He's <laughs> either going to high crush you or low crush you. Yeah. As long as he guesses correctly. Man, Bin Chang seems like he's playing pissed. <laughs> Wouldn't you be? I don't know. Get him. Fast to slide the oh. world. There you go. Mmm. Wow, weird combo. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look at Steve's shoes. Do they seem kind of big to you? <laughs> I suppose so. Is that an item? I don't know. Like what big clown big shoes? <laughs> they look like clown shoes. I oh, can't see them in the snow. Damn, no, starts the route with a hop kick? Well, you gotta do it. When you're a bunghole. Bunghole. <laughs> <laughs> I want Mel Gibson back. Or Mel <laughs> Gibson. <laughs> Mel uh -oh. Gibson. This was high. <laughs> Even though he lost me money. Ben Chang's about to get that dollar back for you, though. Yeah, he's pissed. Did. And he's got Steve when he's pissed. That's a launch punishable uh, low, right? Down three? I don't know if Steve can launch it, though. Yeah, he doesn't have a 15 frame launcher. Oh wow, cool. wake ups. Yeah, that's unsafe. Man, nice, I like these cancels. Jesus. Um, Running them out. Whoa, what's going on in there? Is that a fight? Yeah, it happens a lot. <laughs> Is it, does it really? <laughs> no. It never happened. I, I, I wish I went, dude. I really regret not going. Yeah, the usually when there was a lot of hype going around the first machine, I heard what they were doing was like a, it's like a community thing, where they, like guys on the website just like they want to see how other characters do against a certain character. So one guy will stay on using, like, Kuma, uh -huh. and then everyone else will, like, use their characters, and they'll just keep track of, like, the win count and stuff. Really? Yeah. Man, that's the kind of organized tech and shit that you need to get hella good at the game. Just, mm -hmm. like, knowing everything about every character and stuff. Yeah, I mean, I mean, generally those guys are not, like, the top players either, you know? Yeah. They're just guys that want to learn more about the game and, you know. That's up crazy. I remember Anakin was saying that, like, the random schoolgirls that would come in after school would like fuck him up just to yeah. add as like the best players and shit. Dude, one of the worst beatings I got there was mm -hmm. from these school kids using Alisa. Really? It's like, cause, like, anything that was supposed to do to track to Law's left, mm -hmm. he's just like, I'm gonna sidestep that way anyway. Like, you know, from range zero. Yeah. I'm like, okay, I guess I lose. Like, I there's no option for me here. Yeah, I really regret not going. I mean, I just didn't have the money, but. Yeah. Next time. Next time, man. Next time. They're saying that uh, the new season is going to be really soon. Oh, yeah. I think it already started. Did it? Oh, the qualifier started. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, I mean, it's coming around. Yeah, it's I think they're be... trying to get another season done before uh, Tag 2. Yeah, this will be probably the last season before the Tag 2 season starts. Yeah. <clears throat> so, uh, you uh, thinking you might go back? Oh. Uh, it depends if I stay playing competitively and all. You know, we'll see how that goes. Yeah. Those shoes look really big. <laughs> Someone's holding up coins to the camera. I don't know what the fuck that is. I don't know. You know, LD Maxi was asking me to let him listen to us do this commentary while we do it. Why? I don't know. Like, I just... Oh, damn. Oh, back God. That was sick. Like I said, down back trees in places you wouldn't expect. Um, I don't know why, he just wanted to, and I told him, no, fuck off, and he's like, oh, you know, whatever. Because I feel like he's going to distract me, you know? He, like, always, like, throws in, like, no, that guy's not, uh, this guy, he's that guy. I'm like, whatever, dude. It's Nell Gibson. Wait, he just wants to be on, like, aim with us? Yeah. Like, I told him, why don't you just do commentary with us, and he was like, yeah. oh, it's 3 a.m. here, so, I was like, whatever. Next time. Oh, actually, yeah. Like where he stays, it's like he can't be very loud and stuff because the oh, walls. Oh, really? Stand. Yeah. The walls are made out yeah. of paper and shit. We'll go Dude, with walls. The um, the walls are quite thin. There's a lot to hear. Where did you stay when you were there? We stayed at this little place, like really close to Green Arcade, like literally about a, like a one minute walk. It was so, a hotel. Mm, I wouldn't call it that. <laughs> it was. Uh, <laughs> what was it? What would you call uh, it? I don't know. It's. it's it's kind of like mean a. mean you don't know, dude? What I, was it? We don't have anything like that here, is what I'm saying. It's well, compare it to something. <sighs> Brothel? No. <laughs> Hostel? 
No, I guess it's supposed to be like, you know, like a studio apartment kind of thing, except, you know, small. And like, they rent it out as if it's a hotel. Oh, no shit, that's cool. It's kind of how it was in France when I went there. It was like yeah, an apartment. Yeah, exactly, exactly how it was when I went to France, too. Huh. Well, that's cool. Um, how much was it? Super cheap. Super that's cheap. It's like $25 a day or something. That's awesome, dude. Yeah, ridiculous. Yeah, man, if I get a chance to, I'm going to go to Korea soon. <clears throat> if I can. You should, man. Korean sticks all screwed me up now that I still can't play on Japanese sticks again. No, I'm just gonna have them put Japanese sticks. When I was talking to uh, <laughs> Ni and Nin, they were like, yeah, dude, just come over and tell us to put in Japanese sticks. We got them, so I was like... Oh, yeah, they'll do that for you, I'm sure. Yeah. They have a... Uh, one of the guys there, it's like, I think it's a dual ownership or something for Green Arcade, and uh-huh. the guy is basically the, the tech guy. So he was the one who put the pad ports in for us and all that kind of stuff. That's cool. Yeah, I keep hearing about that mom. Oh, yeah. Green Arcade Mom. Mm-hmm. So, what's she like? Is she cool? Yeah, she's cool. I mean, I think... I'm very interested, and I hope, if you do go to Korea, that mm-hmm. Maxi records your first encounter with her. <laughs> I'll, I'll arrange it so that that happens. I'm totally going to be hitting on her, dude. Yeah. What's <laughs> up, <so>, girl? <laughs> <laughs> what that she... definitely needs to get recorded. <laughs> is she, like, what? Is she, like, really old? I think I've seen pictures. She's, like... Maybe 50, right? Yeah, I guess so. It's hard to tell with Koreans, yeah, dude. Yeah, it's hard. You have to say, because I would have guessed like 40, but then once you said it, I was like, you know, that's possible. It's you know what? I bet you she's even older than that. Korean women always look way younger than they are. She's probably like 60. That's nutty, dude. Yeah, wow. <clears throat> Alright, down to the wire. Let's go, Pung Ho. Pung Ho? Pung Ho? <laughs> it doesn't help that it's character's Lee right after that. You can tell it looks like Pung Ho. Oh, Pung Ho Lee? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> oh, 10 count. Nice. Come on, there you go. Oh, trouble. Is that unsafe? <laughs> that 1-1 uh, one, one down 1 or 1-1 one, or one down 2 or whatever it is? Ooh. Um, no, it's not a mistake. It, it's just mid? Yeah. Really? I gotta turn on my PlayStation. Oh, no punish there. I'm gonna bring it back, though. Nice. Indeed. God, that back one, dude. Still a good move. Yeah. Oh, 2-2-3. Two, two, oh. Nice. I don't like that. I'm liking it. You know, speaking of Lee, GM has been doing really well this year. Really? This yeah, guy. he's taken out Anakin twice now. Yeah. He's won every major so far in America, right? This year? Is that right? Oh, I think so. Yeah, I think that is right. Other than West Coast Warzone, which <laughs> counts totally. I don't... Was that this year? <laughs> what? Yeah, that was this year. Yeah, West Coast Warzone was an amazing tournament. I think there was like, what, 16? Dude, it was huge. I ran that whole tournament by myself, dude. Huge. That's impressive. Best yeah. victory ever. Had. Oh yeah, you won that, huh? <laughs> that was nice. Nice is done. That's going on the top ten of 2011 uh, list. Cool. <laughs> wow, wow, that works really well, dude. You did yeah. that earlier. That's. Uh, I feel like that's a perfect reset up. So down three, Hitman size and step two. right. Huh? Yeah, Hitman size step right two. Yeah. To avoid a jab. I wonder if that works against Dragonov. Sometimes these jabs have different hitboxes. Uh oh, pungo has got a promotion chance. Man. Pick it six dollars? No. I'm not way. even gonna bet anymore. <laughs> <laughs> this is not cool. How is remember how pissed off Bin Chang was when he started? Yeah. Now he's getting his ass kicked. Who you is want Pungo? To have you ever Take even a name from stuff, man? Dude, you know I don't know much about Koreans. You were in Korea! Yeah, dude, but their names are on Korean. I was getting, getting beat by everybody. And they all look the same kind of names. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Did you, like, do you feel like you met a lot of people? A lot of, like, new oh, yeah. players oh, yeah. and shit? Yeah, there's a lot more guys there that speak English than I expected, too. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so it was, it was a lot of fun, actually. Yeah, I bet. How's the food there? Is it better than Japan? 
I like it better, yeah. I mean, I was, I've was i never been a big fan of Japanese food. I mean, I like Japanese curries and katsu and that kind of stuff, but yeah. all, all uh, Korean food and, the, like, you know, bulgogi and all that good stuff. So. That shit's hell good, dude. Yeah, they all, and actually, uh, chicken is actually really big over there. So there was, we went to, like, a bunch of chicken places. Because uh, Fab and I both aren't really big fans of seafood, so it's yeah, another reason. Yeah, fuck that, me either. Man. How is the, uh, like, American food there? Oh, it's good, dude. Really? Yeah, I mean, like McDonald's. Huh? There's, um, they got bulgogi burgers. Damn! <laughs> uh, Shanghai spicy chicken sandwiches and stuff. Damn, it's, dude, that sounds it's... great. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the only thing that was weird, actually, was that the, um, their bacon isn't like bacon. What is it's it? like ham. So it's like, like they don't fry it. I, uh, kinda, but not really. It's like way thinner. Hmm. Yeah, it was, it was weird. Like, I saw, like, a bacon Big Mac. I was like, I gotta have that. And <laughs> then. I got it. I was like, what is this? Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Ouch. How the hell did he get hit by that? And not punish that? He's nervous, man. He's Sonic Fang through. is 14 frames, right? Minus 14? No, no, no it is like 14. Two? Um, I think so, yeah. Yeah, I think so, too. Get him. Nice. Slide. Uh-oh, no throw break. One plus two escape. Final round again. It's always final round between these guys, actually. Yeah, it's because they want to piss me off. <laughs> Pongo. About to lose it, though. There you go. Punch that motherfucker into oh, the wall. Oh, denies my dollar. Easy to do. <laughs> that is easily one of the dumbest things you've ever made up. What? Easy to do? Easy to do. Easy. I didn't make it up, dude. Sure. It's easy to do. Alright, here we go. What? Punish that shit. Oh man, Finn's nice. angry again. Yeah, he is. Is that Steve Bald or does he have like a haircut? Yeah, he's got a haircut. I don't like those shoes. <laughs> Ouch! Beautiful. Get into that wall. Man, I'm starving. <laughs> You're always starving. It's because we always record this shit at like 12 noon and it's like I haven't eaten yet. I'm starving. <laughs> Why don't you just eat beforehand? Oh man! And when Bin Chang has Peng Ho's back to, to the wall, it's like it's usually over. Maybe Peng Ho is like one of those newer players that hasn't like fully fleshed out his wall game, or his get away from the wall game. You've never heard of him either, right? Oh, I mean, look at his win count, though, dude. He's got like five thousand wins. I can't read that, dude. My eyes are really bad. <laughs> Well, he's got like 4,780 something wins, so, uh, so he's been down for a while. He knows what he's doing, I guess. I've yeah, and heard of him, he's, he's also, I, think, I can't tell if that's a 3 or a 1. For, it's either 1,800 or 3,800 losses. So. Well, whatever you do, don't put it on fucking full screen, <laughs> or else uh, <laughs> it's going to reset that shit. I've been on full screen, man. Oh, okay. I started. I'm, I'm on middle screen. <laughs> nice. Get him. Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't get up. Just stay down. Oh my god. Oh man. Why didn't he step on him? He could have stepped on him. I know. He's playing there. Wow. Work. Okay, that was nice. Thank you, Sudo, dude. What do you think about that? Block or sidestep. That's what he thinks yeah, about that. Yeah, sure. Just uh, block everything. I, I've heard that uh, argument so many times over the years. By the way, did he just get promoted? No, he didn't. Now oh. the promotion chance is back. I've heard that shit so many times. It's not that good. All you gotta do is read the highs and read the lows. And it's, you know, give me a fucking break, dude. We're human beings. I think uh, yeah. one of the arguments, though, was that, you know, hot pick is only a part of the game, but, you know, people can also randomly sidestep anything. You know, so... Yeah, but a know. random sidestep takes timing. A random hop kick takes nothing. Just, no, it takes timing, too. No, it doesn't. That's what makes it random. What? If it wasn't, if it was, if it took timing, it would not be random. No, but you could randomly cite that whenever you feel like. Yep, and then if if somebody yeah. happens to do a big move that whips, then you're lucky. You know what I mean? Like you can throw out as many side steps as you want. Yeah, but throwing out a side step is far more uncontrolled than throwing out a hop kick. I mean, when they're in range, they're gonna block it and punish you with a minus twelve. But if you just you could get launched for uh, throwing out a side step easily get launched. I suppose so. I mean, the only argument you could have with that is that you could sidestep the hop kick, but several hop kicks don't, um, 
you, they track to one side, and on top of that, the basic point of a hop kick is to do it when someone's attacking you. So attacking you with a low. Yeah, well, attacking you with a, anything, hoping that it's a low or a throw. Mm -hmm. You know, so if you. Uh oh, my video stopped. What? Why? <laughs> Time. All right, we had a little technical difficulty. <laughs> Rip doesn't, internet. Rip doesn't know how to operate a computer, um, so we're back. And Ten count. Yeah, hopefully, uh, LD Maxi uh, figures out how to edit this and it'll sound <laughs> perfectly seamless, and you listeners won't even know what happened. Forty fourteen. Yeah. For reference. Yeah, forty fourteen. Anyway, all right. So here we go. Trying to get me. Are, my six tied up. Oh, he's getting a little massage from behind. Uh -oh. Final round again. Tell me about this uh, brothel that's downstairs, dude. Oh, we didn't go in it, man. Oh. Anakin went in for a second. Uh oh. And uh, yeah, I mean, this you know, this is this little video of them going in. Oh but, yeah, I think I saw that. It's at the end yeah. of one of the Ghost of Tekkens, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Nice. Come on. Uh, get the dollar. Yes. So what am I down six now? Mm-hmm. Oh god. Oh Vinjay so sad. Alright, now we got Dioxin. Dioxin versus Pung Ho. Oh wait. I do know Pung Ho. How do you know Pung Ho? He's beat the crap out of me with <laughs> oh. <laughs> Damn. So this guy owned your ass and you don't even remember him. Huh? Well see I know I know Dioxin too. This is a, it's a tough call now, man. Oh yeah? Who do you got? Yeah, I'll take Dioxin just because I know him. No, I don't want Dioxin. I want Dioxin. You got Pungho. Alright, fine, fine. I don't like Pungho. Alright. <laughs> I don't like him because he's been costing me money this whole time. Well, the thing is, Dioxin's main is Nina, so... Yeah, I know. Yeah. It'll be alright. Here we go. Yeah, he was so nervous on Tekken Crash, man. Dioxin? Yeah, and he had to play Tong Ball, and... Oh, really? I, re I really feel like if he wasn't nervous, you know, he, he could have beaten him. How do you feel about Tong Ball? I think he's really good. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the thing, you know, when I when I played him at that strong style he came to, I yeah, stuff, like mm -hmm. he beat the crap out of me. It was like five zero, mm -hmm. and you know, I played him there, and it was it was down the last round. It was like we played first to three, mm -hmm. and um, it was down the last round, last hit, you know, two two each. And so I was like, you know, either he's not trying as hard, or <laughs> he's not as good as I remember. Mm -hmm. So. I mean, but everyone I talk to thinks he's, like, you know, ridiculous, one of the best there, and he definitely is. Um, they are talking about the styles of Mishima play over there, and they are yeah. saying that, you know, there's Mish Mishimas who just uh, throw out electrics all day, you know, pressure people. Yeah. But uh, with Tong Ball, it's, you know, he just throws out one electric when it's going to hit you, you know, really? and that's it. Yeah, so... So, uh, versus, uh, like, we're talking, like, Tong Ball against Jismin Face or something, right? Right, exactly. Okay. I and mean, that's exactly the example. Like, because what happened was, I played G-Moon, and he, g sa moon is how you say it, actually. g moon face. Yeah. Um, I played him, and he beat the crap out of me, like, with his one of his Mishimas. And I was like, man, I can't touch this guy. And mm -hmm. then we went to dinner, and I was like, man, how do you guys beat that guy? And then they, start, they brought up this conversation, mm -hmm. and they were saying, like, you know, just this duck. And I was like, what? What are you guys talking about, you know? And, like, yeah. they explained to me that he just throws out electrics all day. And so then I went back and I played him after that. And I just, you know, sat there waiting for him to throw out electrics. And it worked, like, amazingly. And then yeah. I didn't listen to him again. And then he stopped playing me after a couple of matches. So I was oh, like, damn. Oh. Jisman cool. face is on blast, dude. That, you heard well, I'm, I'm just saying, like, I didn't know about that duck in his electric business, you know? If I played it straight up, I would have just lost. Jisman face on blast. Did. Yeah, and he, I never played his Bob act, so I'm kind of upset about that, so... Yeah. He's my favorite, one of my favorite Korean players, so... Yeah, his movement is so awesome. That guy's the shit. And it looks Dioxin. like... Do you know what the deal is with some of these nicknames? I mean, what the fuck does Dioxin mean? I don't know. It don't sounds know. like some kind of disinfectant or something. <laughs> it's, I think it's like... It feels like chemistry to me, man. What? Like, you know, dioxygen nitrate or something? <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm unblockable. I'm gonna roll with the punches here and say, okay. How does that have it make any sense? What? If what? It, how does that make any sense? What if it, what if it does mean dioxygen, whatever? Okay. What the fuck does that mean? His favorite compound, man. Oh. <laughs> uh, 
that's my Look at favorite. that syringe on his back, dude. Oh, okay, all right. Now we're it's starting to make sense. Yeah. His favorite compound. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Who's the really good Anna player over there? 201, right? Yeah. Yeah. Did you get to play him? Uh, no, but we played his team, and we had, like, a random three-on-three. Uh-huh. And he, he, he likes to talk. I like him. Oh, that's cool. He speaks English? Yeah. I don't think so, but he likes to talk anyway. <laughs> oh, hi. Right. Yeah. That's good. Like, when I, when I was playing his teammate, mm -hmm. and he was just yelling out, like, slide, slide, you know, like, <laughs> just because... Like, he was saying that I slide a lot, basically. Oh, really? Talking shit? Mm -hmm. So That's cool. It sounds like a really good time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if I could compare it, it was kind of like that day we were at uh, Sugamo. And uh -huh. I was playing the player and um, Jackler was there and stuff. Yeah. It's kind of like that. Okay. All the time. Talking some shit. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Um, so if you had to say who, like, the top three players that you played there are, who would you say are top three? JDCR, uh, Nin. In order? Oh, no. no okay, not okay. Uh, JDCR, Nin. Uh, what about that, uh, what about that Marta player that pushed your shit in? Yeah, he's good, but I mean, I don't know the character. Okay. So, JDCR, Nin. Character, you know what I mean? So I can't really say he... Um, that I played against. Maybe that high school Elisa. <laughs> beat the crap really? <laughs> and high school Elisa? <laughs> I mean, just as far as, like, how bad I got beat, you know what I mean? Oh. Yeah. It's pretty rough. This, uh, Anna player just did the sickest back turn shit right now. It's really good. Yeah, the action is awesome. And actually, you know, um, I'm actually pretty decent against Nina. Huh? So, I played his Nina, and it's actually, like, so different from any other Nina I've used. He does... What's that, like, corset go back or something? That little misstep back she takes? Yeah. Yeah, he uses that, like, as part of his movement. It's, like, ridiculous. You mean, like, a Hayashida step? Yeah. Not Hayashida, like, I'm used to seeing, though, I guess. Hmm. So, like, he's, like, not obviously just doing Hayashida steps. Yeah, yeah. I and, um, you. you know, like, a lot of Ninas use, like, the size of one cancels. Yeah. Yeah, and he doesn't use it as much. So I was like, what is this guy doing, you know? Like, I wonder if he's better than only practice. Uh, from what I've heard, they play differently. You know what I mean? So, yeah. they're both really good, but they're different. I've been a fan of only practice since, like, Tekken 6.0. Like, I remember when that game came out and I was watching him, I just thought he was really good. So, I've been watching him for a long time. I think he's really good. Yeah, he's he's one of the guys I did not even see. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, yeah. He's not, I think, if I, I may be wrong, but I think he's not from near there. Yeah, probably not. And, you know, also the the Law players didn't come out either, so I was kind of upset about that. Malgu? I, no, I played Malgu. I played him one day. He was there one day, you know, and then... But I never played the other guys, like Isaac or... I don't know. Uh, no Name Law. I'm just saying that, you know, Korea has a lot of Law players, which is why they know the character so well. And the, I didn't only, get... uh, the only Law player I know of Korea is just Malgu. How did you do against him? He destroyed me, man. Oh, really? Yeah, I mean, it's... One of those things where I was off a little bit, and he was taking advantage of it, too, so I was like, oh, well. <laughs> like, I got hit a thousand forward one plus two. Oh, shit. Yeah, so, you know, it is what it is, but get him next time. Yeah. Hong Ho, though, about to take away a dollar. Hong Ho, dude. So I'm, I'm down six right now, right? Yeah. That is unbelievable. Pop. This really, like, this <laughs> could go really bad. Like, what if... I'm like down like 20 soon and shit. <laughs> could happen. Well, you know, it's not gonna happen because you gotta pay me at five, remember? No, I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna happen. I don't know. About that. It's gonna happen. If. Oh, well, fuck. That's retarded, dude. That sucks. <laughs> and we gotta do it at the end of the season. <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? The season of Gosu Tekken. No, dude. Yeah. It's after. It's like if you hit five at the end of one show, that's it, man. Beautiful. Dioxin. So I gotta pay you five no matter what, because I'm down six right now. Yep, that's the plan. I hope I don't have to edit that shit out where you fucked up a little. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand what happened. Wow, nice mix-ups. I like it. You know what that stance is called for her? I think it's like, I want to say cat something, but I might have made that up. Flamingo. <laughs> 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 oh, Pongo fighting back. Man, he's got a serious look on his face. 
Yeah. No one likes to get demoted over there, man. I mean, they, oh, really? you know, they have multiple cards, you know, and yeah. they still take it very seriously, though. Oh, shit. That was pretty good. He just did that sidestep right shit again, except he didn't do the He didn't throw it out. He didn't yeah. do a jab. It's confirming. Oh, he's shaking his head. He's like, fuck this guy. Yeah. Take that. Courtesy of Bunkhole. Wow, starts to match off with a fucking skyrocket or whatever it's called. Blazing kick. Blazing kick? <laughs> whatever. He's gonna go into Flamingo. Flamingo, that shit. Skyrocket. <laughs> Everything is fucking wrong and shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Oh, man. Doesn't want to get demoted. Oh shit. Dioxin counter at four, Juggle. Oh god. Uh oh. Oh, Ball short. Uh oh, it gets it. And we're down to five. Alright, so I owe you five bucks. That is awesome. Alright, well, I think uh, Maxi told me that at the end of the video, I could just, like, do an outro. Yeah, I think he said we can take as long as we want. Yeah, but... He's gonna I'm put a black screen. Pretty tired of talking to you, so, uh... Yeah. <laughs> Alright, man, well, uh, we're gonna... We haven't done this for a while, but we're gonna try and get these out as much as possible, because I guess people like, uh, listening to us talk shit about each other and Korean people. So, uh, yeah. I just like making money. <laughs> 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 Fuck you. <laughs> Alright, man, anyway, we'll catch you guys later. Uh, maybe we'll see you guys next time. Yep. See you guys around.